Well, hello there. I'm in Scotland, Motherwell. And now, if you have been watching for the majority of the season, you'll know that I went to both fixtures between these two clubs earlier in the season. One here at Fir Park, which I'm revisiting today, and the other one at Tynecastle. So if it's anything like any of those games, I'll be very happy. Plenty of goals, a bit of excitement. So let's see it. I'm in the away end this time, of course. Uh, where well, there's a bit of atmosphere and this should be good. There's the ground. Let's get to it. to me lads surely they'll check it right looks a bit dodgy to me looks very dodgy Not even checking it. I don't know, it looked a bit dodgy. <laughs> Fucking hell. Not played very well, I'll put it that way. Very much up against it. Massive improvement needed. This break breakthrough could here could do it. Shit! So afraid to shoot there. So afraid to shoot. Ah, we're in a good time. Come on, you! Prime position here. Prime position. Got to score. Oh, oh. Should be fucking out. Second half is 
three more goals though. Jesus Christ. Already. Not even 20 seconds after kickoff. 20 seconds into the second half. to actually shoot the fucking thing. Why are they so afraid to shoot? That is that, and well, on the balance of things, that was most definitely the correct result, and probably should have been a hell of a lot more just by the way the game went. I just knew just from like what, minute one, it just seemed that it would only ever go one way today. So, not really much else to say other than that, but you know, it was a good trip up. You know, it always is going to Scotland, you know, getting out of, away from home for a bit. It's just an excuse to get out of the house and it was a decent game and a decent atmosphere. So, that'll be that and thank you. Now, I don't know how many people are going to see this, but I thought, you know, if any, uh, I don't know, Scottish viewers were maybe interested in knowing, I'll be doing some um, charity runs and other charity thing, things for charity and I was just, you know, wanted to announce it and it's something I will be doing a lot of and so it'd be nice maybe to stay tuned I will obviously up give updates in on future dates so what things I'll be doing but so it be include 5k's 10k's possibly a half marathon I mean might be a bit off that just yet uh, got a lot of training to do so I'll be getting that done so um, if you listen to this part thank you very much